You'll notice from the next session that I've posed a series of questions to four special guests. First of all, to consider what mathematics means to me and my ideas about how we should be attracting more students to study high levels of mathematics at school. Jackie obviously provided some uh, stimulus for our thoughts around that. And also to pursue mathematics teaching <coughs> as a career. They're only going to have three minutes each to give, them their, give us their views on that, but then we might get some questions and answers again. As you can see from the guest list, we have um, a mathematician, Professor Jackie Ramage, who's the new, from this year, head of the School of Mathematics and Statistics. Jackie is very committed to school education and has spent a lot of time working in that space through previous universities before she came to us, University of Newcastle, University of Wollongong, um, and is really committed to supporting you and to supporting you to support our students at school. Um, we also have um, Associate Professor Leon Palladian, who you all know, and Leon, um, as you know, works in the School of Mathematics and Statistics and is equally committed to school education and teaching. Um, we have Professor Pauline Ross joining us. Now, Pauline is a biologist and has recently taken up a position here at the university where my understanding is that her role is to actually lead uh, teaching and learning initiatives as well. But Pauline, you might like to fill us in a little bit on that when you come up. Um, and then we've got Stuart, who we all know and love, and certainly know and understand Stuart's passion about teaching and learning mathematics. But I'm interested in his views too. So while we get organised for this and we get our first speaker up, could you all please write down for me an answer to this question? Why do you all want to be or are mathematics teachers? What drove you to that career path? Because that might be interesting for you to reflect on that while you're listening to these four people. Why did you decide to become a mathematics teacher? And maybe you've got some ideas about how we can attract more people to this wonderful profession. <coughs> 